Hi, welcome back to Kolsky RC. So, as you've seen from the title today, I want to talk about the new DJI Google F FPV 2 that have just come out. They've just been announced today. NERC FPV's had a video up, and I believe on certain DJI sites, they are actually listed for sale. They're not on the UK store that I can see anyway. Um, and also, I want to talk about what, to me, the more important update, which is the update for the DJI Mini 2. So the latest update for this allows you to record in 2.7K 60 frames per second which to me was the only minor gripe I had about this in the first place. I like filming at 2.7K and the fact I only had 30 frames per second was a little bit of a, a downside for me but now with the latest update you can now record in 2.7K 60 frames per second. There is more to the update which I'll, I'll show you on the screen now. So I'm not going over them, but you'll see on the screen what were the updates and what else was included in this update. The other thing you have to have, the app has to be up to date. So if you're running the app, you have to make sure it's updated. Now, this is a strange thing. So I had an up-to-date app, or what told me was the up-to-date app, for my Samsung S10. It would, when, the, when I put the update on, I still only have 30 frames per second. When I put the update onto an iPhone 8, and then had 60 frames per second. So I'm thinking they might still be behind on Android, it might just be my phone. So if you're on an Android device, you'll have to see if it does it. If you're on Apple, it will definitely work out of the bag. So to me, that is the main thing. This is a really good thing for me. I'm really excited about having 60 frames per second. The other thing I wanted to talk about was, the, these are obviously FPV goggles. These are V1s, if you like. So they brought a V2 out. Uh, and if you've watched Nurk's video, I suggest you watch it, guys. Amazing. If you're not already subscribed to his channel, he goes through what the difference is, and unfortunately, there's hardly any difference. Certainly, nothing that would make me sell these to go buy a, a set. So obviously, I was a bit like everybody else, thinking, "Oh God, I must have bought another set of goggles." Cause, and then the resale value on these would be low. Um, but I'd probably have to bite the bullet at some time and do it, some point and do it. So what I wanted to see was 1080p. Uh, screen so the resolution be 1080p in here I expected they might put OLEDs in here I hope they'd put HDMI out and my other big hope which was a little bit bad was would they put analog and build analog into the goggles now that they really were never going to do that because of what it would do because they, these are digital however they haven't done anything like that they've made the screen resolution seven, they've gone from 720 come feedback to your screen to 810. They've increased the refresh rate from 120 to 144. Don't get me wrong, that is gonna make a difference. If you're a racer, you're gonna notice a slight difference in that screen. But to 99% of the people that bought these, that isn't gonna make a difference. So I'm actually glad there's hardly any difference to the goggles because now I don't have to go out and buy a pair. I certainly won't be updating. The only way I'd have a set of V2s is if something went wrong with these and I had to replace them because it's all I can get. You can only get V2s now. Now the one big thing they do come with is a battery. You get a battery with it now and it's the other type of DJI battery that you uh, press twice to turn on and it shows you how much life you've got in there. But it did, these obviously didn't come with the battery and I believe the, the V2s are now capable up to 6S. So you can run a 6S battery on your goggles instead of 4S. I certainly, to me it doesn't make enough difference and I'd imagine if you really wanted to, I'd imagine this battery will come for sale shortly that's coming out on the strap because the strap's slightly different obviously to, to hold the battery. I bet you can buy them very, very shortly. So I presume it's a lithium ion battery that it comes with. I'd imagine they're going to come out soon but there's not enough there that's going to make me go, oh, I need to go buy them because they're certainly, to me, not enough. And I needed to see one of the things mentioned that I mentioned before. So if I had HDMI out, I might have been tempted. 1080p would certainly have been a winner for me and I'd have gone for it. Uh, but 810s here and there to me. Obviously, there's a bit of difference. I'm not saying for one minute it's not different, but it's not enough to make me go buy them. If you've not got a set and you're looking to buy them, fantastic. Because I think there's only £30 difference in between the price of V1s to V2s. And it's worth it to get the battery and the different strap. So... Just a quick video today. I'm going to have another video later in the week. I was going to incorporate into this one with the latest stuff that's come out. There's quite a new uh, 
quite a lot of products just come out and also I wanted to talk about something about trying to buy stuff from Banggood because I believe you can't buy as much stuff as you can because I'm going on to it now and a lot of stuff says not available to ship to your location now whether that's because of we've just uh, if you we're in the UK and we've just left Europe whether that's made a difference I don't know but I have noticed that we'll talk about that in a video that's coming up with also the new product so thanks ever so much for watching quick video today have a fantastic day I'll obviously have a flight footage as soon as it stops being hot I don't know if you can see out my windows but it's disgustingly grey and rainy and it has been for days now so when the weather's great uh, well not great when it improves and there's no rain uh, I will take this up and film a 2.760 frames per second video, quick 10 minute video and I'll put that online so you can see the difference. I, I know you can tell the difference between the 2.760 and uh, 2.730 so I'll put that online. Again, I'll just do raw video so you can see it on your screen see what it looks like. But that's it. Have a fantastic day.